Hey guys, it's Kamari Vaughn. Welcome back to my channel. So today is the first day I'm going to be doing a story time video. And honestly, the only reason why I felt like this story was relevant to my channel is because my channel is about natural hair. So I just decided to share this story with you guys because it's a good story to me. So this story is about how a white girl commented on my natural hair, you know, telling me how it was um, very dirty. Um, let's just get into the story time. So at my high school, there is, it's a melting pot of a lot of different braces of a lot of different girls. And the majority of the African-American girls at my school, we wear our hair natural. And that is, I don't know a lot of girls in my school who have perms. If you come down the hallway, all you'll see is straight curls. And I love that about my school because I'm able to learn about different people and what they do with their hair. But I know how to approach the conversation. So, um, I was in my last class of the day. And they're dismissing everybody. I was a freshman, so they go down from sophomore, junior. <laughs> Wait, I said that's so wrong. From senior, junior, sophomore to freshman. So we're the very last to get dismissed, so we had a wow. So I was talking to my friends, you know, we were all talking about our hair. Hair is like the conversation you'll hear every day. We were talking about our hair and what we did to it and all of that stuff. So we were all talking and everything, waiting to get dismissed. And the girl who's Caucasian comes up to me and well, she comes up to me and my friends as we're talking. I'm sitting down, so she's like standing over me. And she says, you know, like, your hair, it looks so oily. And we're kind of just looking at her like, you know, like this yeah, this has never happened to any of us. Keep in mind this through the whole video. This has never happened. I've never encountered anything like this. So we're just kind of looking at her like, what do you mean? She's like, you know, it's just so dirty. And she's talking about my hair. And she's like, it's just so dirty. Oh my gosh. And we're like, you know, it's not dirty. We don't we don't wash our hair every day like you do, you know. It's harder for us to maintain moisture. So we don't wash our hair every day or however many times you wash your hair. You know, trying to teach her come across in a respectful way versus how she was coming at me. So, you know, she's like, oh, well, like, why don't you do that? So my hair was in a twist out. It was very, very big and very voluptuous. And she was just saying, you know, it's just such a mess. And, you know, at that point, I'm just like, like, am I being punked right now? Like, I, like, we were all speechless, you know, not knowing what to say and what to do about this situation. So I was just like. I was like, what, what, do you, what do you mean? Like, what, what do you mean? So she's like, you know, it's just like one big mess and it's just so greasy. And she, she repeated herself a lot. She's like, you know, it's just so greasy and it's just so oily and dirty and nasty. And we're just like, like, is this white girl really talking about my hair right now? So then, you know, we start to like school her on natural hair and everything. You were like, you know, this is called a twist out. Like if you're going to come, come correct. This is called a twist out. Okay. We moisturize our hair every few days, honey. We don't wash our hair every day. We wash our hair every two weeks. My hair is not dirty. Okay. Just because you see oil coming off on your hair. That means I put oil in it. She's like, oh, I don't put oil in my hair. I was like, okay. Well, I'm telling you what we do and why we do it. So open your ears so that you don't do this again. You know, that's how I was taken. I was like, you know, I'm going to just let this be a learning experience for her. And I'm going to tell her, this is why my hair is oily. It's not dirty. And she just had this confused look on her face. Like, like I don't understand. And we were like, you know, it's not really for you to understand. So this conversation went on for about five minutes about how messy and dirty my twist out was. And you know, after that, I did a lot of self-reflection. And I was like, it, 
does that really happen? You know, because it's kind of hard when you're in that situation. Because you're just in shock. Like, whoa. This is the hair that grows out of my scalp. And she just called it a mess. <laughs> like, it really just shows you how a lot of white people, um... They still don't understand our natural hair and they don't understand that this is the way it comes out of my scalp. Just because it doesn't look like yours does not mean that there's anything wrong with it. And as I was talking to her, I kept this same tone because I felt like it was my duty to educate her before she came across the wrong one. It, it was an interesting experience, to say the least. So after that, I didn't talk to her. Mm -mm, no, ma'am. Nope. After that whole ordeal, I was like, I don't want anything to do with this child. Nope, nope, nope. But that's the end of my story time. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Bye, guys.